So fish is one of my like all time favorites to cook. Uh, I think though, so often it just gets done so wrong. So I'm just gonna do something real simple today, just some salmon and some peas. Um, I'll show you guys how to execute it really, really easily. Make a little nice um, herb mayonnaise to go with it. Uh, and I'll run you through what we've got. First up, we've just got some salmon with the skin on, which we're gonna take off in a moment. Egg, lemon, dill, peas, mayonnaise, and oil. So. This kind of dish is something that's actually quite high in fat. Uh, most of it's good fat, so, which is good, but it's also low carb. So this is something that's ideal for like lunch, especially if you're doing something like a, like a carb backloading kind of thing. So first thing is we're gonna get our salmon ready. While we're getting that ready, I'm gonna get our pan on and hot. So one little hack that I absolutely love is put a little bit of wet paper towel underneath your chopping board and things don't move. Okay, so let's get the skin off this salmon. Right, open the salmon, you want a nice sharp knife. And then all you're gonna do is just make a really small incision. If you're not comfortable doing this, you can get um, get the guys at the fish shop to do it or the fish market wherever you buy, you buy your salmon. And then you're actually just cutting against the skin and you're pressing the knife down into the skin and it takes your your skin off just because you don't want to eat all the all the scales. So that's one. Ooh. Two. All right. And we're gonna cook our salmon this side down. You want the best side cooked first for presentation. So you can see this is like nice and you know fresh cut, it's not all bloody like, like this side. Um, so that's gonna be the side we'll cook the salmon on. All right, so while that heats up, we're gonna make our mayo. So this is one of my favorite things to make, this, this mayonnaise, just because it's so like ridiculously easy. So first thing is you've got your mustard in the bowl. You wanna crack a whole egg straight in, and you really, really wanna try and take care to not break the egg yolk. And then lemon for seasoning. Salt for seasoning. So you wanna make sure you pour your oil in so that it doesn't mix around too much. So I try to kind of aim for the egg yolk and then you're aiming for about 150 mils. Right, and then this is where the magic starts to happen. You wanna make sure you get the tip of your blender right in the center of the egg yolk, and then just blend. So just keep it still, like don't move it around too much. So the egg yolk's gonna help emulsify it. And once it looks like it's not moving much anymore, then you can slowly start to lift it up to allow a little bit more oil in. But you don't want to move it up too fast, otherwise that's going to make your mayonnaise split. And then once it looks like it's not moving, then you can start to move the blender around a little bit. Oh. And then that makes your mayonnaise. Easy. So you end up with like a lovely, creamy, smooth, beautiful mayo. So the trick to getting really nice fish is to only cook it on one side. So a couple tablespoons of oil in the pan, just to make sure that the heat contacts with the, uh, the fish properly. Season your fish. Make sure your pan's nice and hot. And then you just wanna gently place your fish presentation side down, and that's it and then you're just gonna let that cook. And all we wanna do is regulate the heat so it doesn't burn. So we wanna keep it as high as possible. While that's going, so while the salmon's going, just gonna pick some, wash and pick some dill and put that into our mayo. All right, so our fish is almost there. So I'm gonna turn the heat off. but actually just flip it over, just so it can finish cooking. And we've got a nice crispy side. So 
So just keep this really, really nice and simple. A little bit of lemon on the peas. Nice small little bed of peas. Little tip with presentation, if you stack it high and close to the center, usually it looks nicer. Peas. Then salmon on top. A nice little dollop of your mayo. A little bit of herb to make it look pretty. And then you're done. Easy. Thank you.